Good morning everyone and welcome to a new video. Uh, it is actually a new year. Welcome to uh, 2022. Um, I didn't feel much at the end of last year. I just, I just kind of stopped. But I am back now and today I have come to Wembury Beach. I think that's, I think that is where I am. Um, I was going to get here for sunrise but obviously as you can see from behind me it has been sunrise uh, and it's quite a nice day actually um, but basically I got up too late and also um, on the way here like what the town that you have to drive through to get here um, had a load of new roads on it uh, that the sat nav did not recognize and it thought I had driven into a field uh, but I made it now um, so there's quite a lot of rock pools and stuff here so and some nice scenery to take photographs of. So I don't know what I'll see, but I hope you enjoyed the video. Hi guys, uh, so it's actually half ten now. I arrived at like half eight. I'm not sure where the last two hours have gone, um, but I didn't film much um, except for with my GoPro. So I did film quite a lot, but not like vlog stuff, more like GoPro footage. Um, I've been walking around all the um, rock pools. I'm not sure if I have um, managed to like film anything of any value. I, I have no idea. I've never used the GoPro in rock pools before so I don't know what it'll turn out like. Um, what I think I'm gonna do is have a snack and then I gotta go home um, <laughs> because I was only meant to be here for the morning um, and it was quite a drive. Um, but I think I'll like go home and I'll like set up the GoPro footage and my computer and then film watching it and like talking about what I got. Um, because I didn't personally see any, like, I didn't see any crabs or starfish or anything in the rock pools. I mean, I don't know if they're, like, seasonal or not. Um, I have no idea. Um, but maybe the GoPro picked up something cool. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go have a snack now. And I will see you back at home where I will go through the footage and the photos that I took as well earlier. Hi guys and welcome back to the video. It has actually been about two weeks since I went to the beach. I got distracted when I got back and then I just forgot that I filmed all that thing at the beach and all the rock pools and stuff. Um, I have looked through the footage. I've also realised that I say um quite a lot in this video. I'm not sure why. Anyway, I've set up my computer so I can like go through the photos and some of the rock pool stuff that I got and talk you through it. I can't record myself whilst recording the computer screen. Uh, I tried that and it just, it was too much for the, <laughs> too much for the country Wi-Fi. So instead it's just gonna be the photos. So I thought I'd do a little introduction now. I hope, I'm trying to keep it steady, but I hope I'm not like walking my phone too much. Anyway, we're gonna go through the photos and I'll show you what I got. I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. Bye. Hello guys, so I'm hoping that you can see the screen right now because I'm not sure if there's a bit of like a layover in me speaking and the and like the, the video, the screen recording, recording. Um, I can't seem to get it to work with Lightroom so I can't show you the photos I took on my DSLR, unfortunately. I have to add them on at the end of the video. But it does seem okay with the GoPro footage, so I'm gonna go through some of that now. Not all of it, because I took quite a lot <laughs> in several different rock pools and most of it is not worth watching, but I'm gonna show you this video and then a few of the like screen grabs from other videos and explain um, a bit about them and what I managed to um, like photograph and then um, and then improvements I can do next time and the and what I can do 
to take better photos next time basically so this is the first video i think it should be playing now so basically this is the um best video that i took on the gopro but mainly because the subject is really interesting and vibrant and you can see all the colors of the seaweed but most of the other videos are just uh, the rock pools didn't have much in there was like a few rocks and like sand and shells but this one had the most colors in um, as you can see from the video, it's very quick, You could, like nothing, the camera's not focusing on anything and it's kind of <laughs> just a blur of seaweed colours and different plants and stuff so next time I definitely need to move the cam camera slower and like focus it on areas to make sure that it's able to focus on the subjects because this is basically what ev all the other footage looked like as well it's just way too quickly moving around the water so it didn't really capture anything in good focus um if i go back to the screen some of the screenshots from the other footage i'm hoping you can see this um, is it saying is it? oh yeah it is it's caught up um i mean this is another this is like completely blurry but it does show what potentially I could get if I was better recording with the GoPro um, so this rock pool obviously had loads. this was a much deeper one than the seaweed one um, I think in I need to like move the GoPro further into the rock pool and put, like um, further away from the edges of where the plants are like seaweed and stuff so then you can get clearer shots if I move along there is if it loads yeah I quite like this one I'm not sure why it's upside down that's better um, mainly because the light looks really cool around the seaweed here so this one turned out quite well compared to the others but again it's not completely in focus is it going to zoom no uh, there we go. It's not completely in focus and I think if I held the GoPro slower in the rock pool it could be more in focus. Uh, let's go to the next one. Yeah, again, this is all, this was all from the same rock pool I'm assuming. I can't actually remember if I got it from the same footage or not. But yeah, again, if I moved the GoPro further away. But it still looks pretty cool to be fair. And Oh, I think that's upside down. And as a first attempt with um, using the GoPro in rock pools, I'm quite happy. I mean, I didn't actually see any like, crabs or starfish or anything. Ooh, that is like a whole 360 turn. I think it's meant to be that way around. Um, so I didn't actually see anything other than the seaweed. I mean, the seaweed looked cool, but it's not like an animal, is it really? I'm not sure if there's like a different time of year for those sort of things. Yeah, so again, you can see that I'm way too close to the side of the rock pool to take clear photos. Oh, I've watched the video already. Now, oh, these are ones from the video I just showed you. Um, the, I quite like these shots mainly because the colours are really vibrant and like the seaweed looks really cool. And I didn't, I couldn't see that from above the rock pool. I didn't know what it looked like until. I reviewed the footage later and it turns out this rock pool was like filled with loads of vibrant coloured seaweeds and plants and stuff but again I was moving the GoPro way too fast so none of it is really in focus I mean this one is definitely not in focus you can see all the different colours but you can't really see what's going on because it's just way too fast uh, this one was actually from a rock pool that was connected to the ocean more so that the waves were like coming in and out that's why there's loads of like debris and stuff floating around which I think was kind of fun I was just kind of having fun at this point but it does show what I could potentially film in the future oh yeah I don't even know what that <laughs> what's this no, the way too fast with the GoPro oh, Back to the beginning again. Where's the last one? Oh, oh, this one. This one is my favourite photo that I managed to get on the GoPro. Uh, mainly, I like it because it looks a bit like the fish tank from Nemo. Um, I think it does anyway. And also, it's like a way 
you can like this if i had held the gopro here for longer than a second then i probably would have got a clearer photo of this but i didn't so <laughs> that's a tip for next time go slowly with the gopro in rock balls to catch a clear photos but yes i think that is all the that is why i managed to i think this is the best one and the colors look amazing in this one but yeah that's what i managed to get on the um gopro in the rock pools um i'm think i'm planning on going back to the same spot again in the next month i think and i'm going to try again and see if i can like implement my going slower and further away from the edge of the rock pool tips to see if i can get better images so maybe i'll make another video of that unfortunately it's not letting me show lightroom so i'll have to put those photos up in a second without me speaking through them but yeah it was quite a successful trip actually and the weather was really nice um so i think i'm definitely going to go back there in the future and try again and maybe see if i can get some clearer shots anyway i hope you enjoyed today's video and see you next week